Mind-reading AI unlocking the human brain like never before. What if your thoughts weren't just private signals bouncing inside your skull? What if technology could access, interpret, and even predict them before you speak a single word? That's not a concept from the future. It's happening now. Thanks to breakthroughs in artificial intelligence and neuroscience, researchers are getting closer to decoding the most private part of human existence, your mind. And it's not magic. It's science. This video breaks down how cutting-edge AI is learning to read human brainwaves, the incredible possibilities this opens up, and the massive ethical questions it brings. Let's unpack how AI is finally starting to understand the mind, one electrical signal at a time. The birth of thought decoding, it expanded. At the center of this revolution is a powerful tool, EEG, short for electroencephalography. EEG measures the electrical activity of the brain using small sensors placed on the scalp. These sensors capture wave-like signals generated by neurons firing in your brain. Every time you think, move, feel, or even imagine something, EEG data has existed for decades decades in clinical settings, mainly to diagnose conditions like epilepsy or brain injuries. But here's the catch. Interpreting EEGs has always been incredibly difficult. The signals are messy, constantly shifting, and hard for even trained neurologists to fully understand. The data changes second by second, is easily distorted by muscle movement or background noise, and varies from person to person, making pattern recognition nearly impossible through traditional methods. That's where AI steps in. Enter Pyramidal, a mind decoding AI startup expanded. A company named Pyramidal, backed by Y Combinator, is at the forefront of this AI neuroscience fusion. Their innovation? Training the largest EEG-based AI model in the world. Instead of teaching machines to analyze images or text like many traditional AIs, Pyramidal feeds it brainwaves, raw neurological data. The goal is to build a model that can accurately read, analyze, and interpret what the human brain is doing in real time. Think of it as ChatGPT, but instead of responding to your words, it responds to your brain's electrical language. This system learns to identify patterns in EEG data that correspond to emotions, stress levels, focus, or even subconscious responses. Over time, it becomes better at recognizing brain states, whether someone is relaxed, anxious, sleepy, or alert. Eventually, it may even be able to decode intent, silently assisting with interfaces like brain-computer controls or communication for patients who are unable to speak or move. But that's just the start. Decoding the brain in hospitals expanded. The most immediate application of this tech is in medicine. Neurology departments, especially in ICU settings, rely heavily on EEG data. But reading these signals takes time, and time is something critical patients often don't have. Pyramidal's AI is already being tested in hospitals like King's College and St. Thomas in England. In these trials, the AI monitors EEG signals from patients in real time, identifying key events such as seizures or brain hemorrhages before a human doctor even has time to scan the report. The AI doesn't just send an alert, it can interpret whether the seizure is likely due to epilepsy, a stroke, or trauma, drastically improving the speed and accuracy of diagnosis. It can even distinguish between seizure types and severity giving doctors faster data to triage cases and start targeted treatment earlier. In an emergency room or neuro ICU, this is more than helpful. It's life-saving. Revolutionizing neurology diagnosis. Traditionally, diagnosing disorders like Parkinson's or Alzheimer's involves long-term observation, brain scans, and subjective assessments. But AI could change that by identifying hidden biomarkers, subtle electrical patterns in the brain that humans can't detect with current tools. Pyramidal's model is being trained across across a wide spectrum of neurological data, which means it's not just good at detecting known disorders, it might even discover entirely new neurological patterns that don't yet have names or diagnostic criteria. By learning to spot anomalies invisible to human eyes, the AI could offer early warnings of neurodegenerative diseases before symptoms appear, leading to earlier intervention, more personalized treatments, and possibly even slowing or halting disease progression. This could transform neurology from a reactive field into a a proactive science of prevention, changing not just how we treat the brain, but how we understand it. Mental health personalized monitoring and the consumer shift. What happens when this technology leaves the hospital? Imagine wearing headphones or a smartwatch that tracks your brain activity throughout the day. Not just heart rate or steps, but your focus, anxiety, emotional balance, and sleep quality. AI could tailor music or guided meditation to your stress levels in real time. If your concentration dips, your device could suggest when to take a break. If you're entering a sleep cycle, it might adjust room temperature or sound. This is the next level of personalized health tech. Your emotional and mental states decoded directly from your brain, not your words or behaviors. 
For people battling stress, A, DHD, insomnia, or anxiety, real-time feedback based on E, E, G patterns could offer insights and daily support previously unimaginable. The ethical dilemma, who controls your mind data? But with this power comes a deep ethical concern, privacy. Reading your brainwaves isn't like tracking your online searches. It's much more intimate. We're talking about the potential to monitor inner thoughts, impulses, and feelings. And that raises chilling questions. Who owns your EEG data? Can it be sold or shared? What if a device starts analyzing your brain without proper consent? In the wrong hands, this data could be exploited for advertising, manipulation, or even political control. And yes, mind hacking isn't fiction anymore. As AI improves, so do risks. We've already seen issues with social media tracking our attention and emotions. Brain data could become the next frontier in surveillance capitalism. That's why experts emphasize the need for strict regulation, consent laws, and public transparency. Without it, the very tool meant to heal minds could become a tool to control them. Real-world testing, the pyramidal pilot. In hospitals using Pyramidal's model, EEG data is streamed directly to the AI in real time. The model continuously analyzes for critical patterns, detecting early warning signs of seizures, trauma, or abnormalities in brain function. One of the most promising features, the AI doesn't just detect issues, it provides context, why the problem is happening, what the likely cause is, and how it's progressing. Doctors using this tool have reported more confident decision-making, faster responses, and fewer diagnostic errors. These early trials show what happens when AI doesn't replace humans, but amplifies their intelligence. Global expansion, a future in every clinic. Pyramidal's long-term vision isn't limited to a few elite hospitals. Their goal is to democratize brain AI. They want this system to be deployed globally, in clinics, hospitals, therapy centers, and eventually in consumer electronics. If successful, we could see brain monitoring AI embedded in sleep tracking headbands, meditation devices, wearable neurofeedback trainers, VR headsets that respond to brainwaves. The idea is simple. Use AI to give everyone insight into their own minds, not just patients with severe conditions. Unlocking the human psyche. Beyond diagnosis and daily health lies something even deeper the potential to use AI to explore human consciousness itself. As models grow smarter, they could begin decoding not just what someone is thinking, but why. Why do we feel certain emotions in specific patterns? How do thought loops and mental habits form? Can AI help uncover emotional trauma stored in neural patterns? This opens up new frontiers in psychology, neuroscience, and even philosophy. Concepts like emotional intelligence, creativity, or introspection may soon have measurable signatures in brainwave data. Understanding consciousness at the neural level could fundamentally change how we perceive identity, decision-making, memory, and even free will. The road ahead, hope versus risk. We are entering an age where thoughts may no longer stay private. In this world, your mental state could be constantly monitored, not just for health, but for productivity, social behavior, or consumer prediction. The question is not whether A, I will be able to decode the brain. That's already happening. The real question is, what will we do with this power? Will we use it to heal or to manipulate, to liberate minds or to exploit them? What's needed now is balance, innovation backed by caution, exploration guided by ethics. Because once AI can read your mind, there's no going back. If this blew your mind, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Let us know your thoughts on mind reading AI in the comments below and hit the bell icon so you never miss the next frontier in science and technology.